Hello everyone, Gianluca Masi speaking on the behalf of the Virtual Telescope Project and while we announced that this event was going to be cancelled before because of clouds, I just spotted a clear spell in the sky and I decided to open this live feed even if, if for a few minutes because we are getting some reasonably good images of the object and I want to share with you what we are having now, my friends. These are images coming live from our telescope when we can see, of course, the spiral galaxy Messier 100 with the bright evidence of the dwarf planet Ceres. Here it is. This is the spiral galaxy and this bright object on the right of its nucleus is the bright dwarf planet Ceres. I'm happy that at least I could share this quick view and hopefully bringing to you the unique event we have been waiting for several weeks now. Perhaps this is better, I don't know, because there are clouds moving around all the time. <clears throat> Trying to adjust the look, how beautiful is this? Now, the spiral galaxy, Messier 100, one of the most beautiful deep sky gems in the sky, is showing so well with the, apparently together with dwarf planet Ceres. Don't be confused because the galaxy is about 55, 55 millions of light years far away while Ceres is in our solar system less than 250 millions of kilometers so kilometers versus light years so happy that we are able to bring this view to you no matter the weather my friends i was absolutely not sure we could bring this live and in fact i announced that this event was cancelled but uh, as soon as I spotted some uh, clear spells in the sky, I decided to try and go to bring to you what we promised. This is the spiral galaxy Messier 100 together with the, the bright dwarf planet, this one, Ceres which has been called for a long time asteroid, actually the first one to be discovered on the 1st of January 1801 from Italy, by the way, Palermo Giuseppe Piazzi, the name of the discoverer. <coughs> so happy that we could spot this gem. Images are coming from uh, our robotic telescopes in Italy. I hope the vision is of interest for you as well. The largest minor body in the inner solar system. called asteroid for a long time is now shining as a matter of perspective in the same direction of this uh, wonderful spiral galaxy Messi 100. I thank all of you joining after the great success we had a couple of nights ago with the very close approaching asteroid 2023 DZ2. <clears throat> How beautiful this is. I've been waiting for more than one month to look at this and share with you.
the spiral galaxy mc100 is shining apparently in the same direction as Ceres. <coughs> Waiting for the new image to show. Ceres is of course the brightest object here in the in the, the field of view, right of the galaxy. I am so happy that at least we could open the observatory and have this quick view for a few minutes. And uh, at least we can say how beautiful this site is putting together as a matter of uh, mere perspective the distant spiral galaxy Messier 100 which is uh, 55 million light years away with the, the dwarf planet Ceres for a long time uh, called asteroid the first asteroid to be discovered in uh, 1801 which is uh, less than 250 million of kilometers in our solar system of course between Mars and Jupiter the so-called asteroid belt but keep in mind, this is one of the handful of dwarf planets defined since 2006. And uh, Pluto, the X9 planet, is perhaps the most famous member of this small family. Just waiting for the new image to download. Here we come. Let's adjust contrast and brightness because this is a, a longer exposure. And let's see what we have. Not bad at all, I think. So friends, I'm now going to close the telescope, the observatory, because it is not safe to keep it running under this truly uncertain weather. At least I could open for a while and bring to you this, this view, the wonderful sight of the spiral galaxy Messier 100 shining for just a question of perspective in the same spot of heaven as the dwarf planet Ceres. I hope you appreciated this quick sight brought to you by the Virtual Telescope Project. Gianluca Masi is speaking from Rome. I'm looking forward to share more. We are planning a live feed covering the planetary alignment you have been hearing around now the last days. So keep an eye on our website www.virtualtelescope.eu and soon we will learn how to join that next experience. That's all, Gianluca Massi, Virtual Telescope Project, Italy.